August the 17th on Saturday. This is the current condition of my skin. I have breakouts here, my jawline. The reason why I want to test this out is because I'm testing out organic oregano oil with added vitamin E. It says right here. So it's an antioxidant for the maintenance of good health. So I actually heard of this because apparently oil of oregano, I've heard people take it when they have acne or like gut problems. Usually like when you have acne, it can be linked to gut problems and bad bacteria in the gut. So oil of oregano is basically supposed supposed to be like a natural antibiotic that you take internally and also I assume you could apply it topically. We're gonna do both. So with this it says you need to take four drops diluted with water or you can mix it with food. On its own it's gonna be way too strong. I actually already took this internally today just because I was uh, very curious and I took it by itself and it was so 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 strong. So we're not gonna do that. I'm probably gonna dilute this four drops with water every single morning and then take my probiotic towards the evening so then I'm not gonna clash this with my probiotic. A lot of people like when they do have acne a lot of doctors prescribe them antibiotics so then it'll cancel out all that bacteria but also gets rid of the good bacteria as well. Basically instead of taking antibiotics for my acne I figured I would try a more natural solution and just see if this will work. This is what it looks like. I didn't even put toner on like I literally am just going to use this every single evening with nothing else. I will dilute it though with a moisturizer so I'm just gonna use this Derma E 12,000 IU cream. Probably a good idea to dilute this oil a bit. Oh man, it's a strong potent scent. Then we are just going to apply it. This is supposed to again act as an antibacterial and again I've heard so many good things about this stuff for acne and I could only hope that my skin will become a bit more clear and yeah that's it I'll keep updating you every single day Good morning everyone Early was in the middle of doing my makeup and, and I totally forgot to take the oil of oregano so we're just going to do that now I've never diluted it with water before because um I was being a, a little stupid this is the water I'm gonna dilute it with what one, two, three, four. Okay, it's such a strong smell. Like, it, I see the oil just like, it's so gross. But anyway, I'm gonna go for it. That was not as bad as I thought. Definitely not as bad as taking it completely straight, which I did on accident yesterday because I didn't think it was gonna be as strong. Diluting it with some water, definitely uh, highly recommend that. See you soon. Just reading the health benefits of oregano and apparently, oh my God, apparently oregano is high in antioxidants. Apparently it's more potent than actual vitamin E. It's very anti-inflammatory and good against colds. You're trying to again fight any inflammation, so AKA that'd be good for acne. And that's pretty much all that says. So yeah. Very antioxidant rich and yeah, we'll see. So it is Tuesday, so I guess this is day four. Consuming morning, four drops of this. Two, three, four, and for good measure. Rocking the sleeveless top. Here's some drops. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. I do an extra drop of good measure. Let's drink. Officially, August 24th, Saturday. Wow, time goes by so fast. Honestly, I don't even remember August being a thing. <laughs> this month went by so fast, and I know it's gonna go by. It's gonna go by like so much more faster, and I know that it's gonna still keep going by so fast. But anyway, I wanted to just give you my final thoughts and review on the oil of oregano. So it definitely tastes a bit off-putting, not gonna lie. My digestion has been a bit better. I'm not sure if I would blame that completely on the oil of oregano, but I have been feeling a bit more energized. It could be definitely placebo, but then again, oil of oregano is supposed to be a natural antibiotic, so it's supposed to kind of like kill off the bad bacteria or any like inflammation. It's not like a cure-all. It's definitely something that's good to add onto your diet, not necessarily just rely on only taking that though. As for skin updates, my skin kind of pretty much looks the same.
same, but as I am on my journey to kind of figure out what the heck is wrong with my digestion, I guess it's something good to take for at least a peace of mind, just knowing that like at least I can have some good supplements, I guess, in my diet. Still trying to figure out what kind of other supplements I can incorporate into my overall lifestyle. And also, stay tuned for my food intolerance test and my hormone test. I'm going to be receiving that hopefully within a week. So I'm so excited for that. Hopefully there'll be a video on that. I honestly just wanted to see what the hype was about with this oil of oregano. As you saw, I kind of stopped putting the oil of oregano on my face just because I read the directions and they say like, make sure you do not put it near your eye area. So I'm like, okay, maybe I should not <laughs> do that. And also I feel like I got a bit of texture the next day. So I kind of just stopped it, but this was fun to test either way. At least now I know that it's not a be all and all cure supplement. I wanted to try oil of oregano for literally months now and I just finally gotten around to it and been like, okay, I just really want to try this. And yeah, I don't think there's anything wrong with adding it into your everyday life just as a supplement. People supplement so many things all the time and I feel like oil of oregano is more of like a natural way to kind of like possibly even prevent blues or colds. I could probably do like a one month update with oil of oregano, do a video about that just to keep you updated. This is again first impressions. Obviously do your own research before you try it. I will end it off here. <laughs> Hope you have a good day, good night wherever you're watching this. Subscribe for more videos if you want to see more of me. See you all beautiful people of the world and like this video if you liked it and yeah. <laughs> I'm so awkward. I can't end videos properly. But okay, I will see you in the next video. Peace. <laughs>